Kyoto Animation is a Japanese animation studio and a light novel publisher located in Uji, Kyoto Prefecture, Japan. During the morning hours of July 18th, an arson attack was carried out at the studio, which resulted in multiple deaths and injuries. My heart goes out to all the people affected, and it is... Um, it's, it's baffling that someone could commit such a heinous act. Uh, but, uh, yeah, uh, rest in peace to wonderful human beings that were expressing uh, their love for creativity and art by creating uh, wonderful stories for the world to enjoy. And, and I kind of wanted to pay tribute to that in a, in a small way by highlighting uh, some of my favorite um, Kyoto animation titles that I own in my library of anime. Uh, they, uh, they were abbreviated as Kyo-Ani, Kyo -Ani, I think I uh, said that right, um, or they still are. And uh, I do want to point out that there it was, uh, there is a fundraiser uh, that um, Sentai Filmworks um, started. Uh, hashtag uh, help Kyo Ani heal. I'll put the link in the description below if you want to check that out. They do such wonderful work. Amazing titles like uh, Sound Euphonium, Violet Evergarden, um, and all of the ones that I'm going to show you here that I've watched and, and, and thoroughly enjoy. Um, if you want to, if you just want to have a wonderful time watching a powerful, beautifully drawn uh, movie, and uh, yeah, A Silent Voice was easily one of the best uh, animated motion pictures of recent memory. Um, Clannad, one of my favorite uh, shows. This <laughs> wrecked me. I love this uh, so much, uh, following the story of all these cute uh, characters growing up into adulthood and all the trials and tribulations that come with it. And uh, it's just a, a, one of those classic shows that everybody mentions. Uh, it's, it, it's a wonderful, beautiful story, but it, it can be a little bit of a, a tearjerker. But yeah, Clannad was really good as well. Um, Technically, seasons two and the movie, but I'm going to show off everything. It is uh, Haruhi Suzumiya. This is uh, the set for the two seasons. About right there. And the disappearance of Haruhi Suzumiya, the movie. Wonderful, lovely uh, written series that is just... Um, it's also one of the classics, you know, uh, the studio really worked on just epic series that everybody could love and you could find something to like, regardless of the title. Uh, Hyoka is another series that I do recommend. It's pretty fun and gorgeously animated. This is probably one of my favorites out of everything here in the animation style. I love this. This is uh, set one and set two. Uh, let's see, Love, Chunibyo, and Other Delusions. This is a recent title that I acquired. It's an oldie but a goodie, or a modern uh, fan favorite, right there. This has um, seasons one and two, and the OVAs. Uh, Myriad Colors Phantom World. This is the Essential Edition. Really fun show as well. Kind of fan servicey, but still, it's pretty funny. And uh, one of my favorites, uh, it is uh, Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. Lovely, lovely, uh, wholesome, uh, funny show. But yeah, that is some of the works um, from a really wonderful studio. And it's just um, a, a tragedy that something like this could happen. And again, my heart goes out to all the people affected. And I wish everybody to be safe and and uh, nothing but the very best blessings to everybody uh, and, and be good do good and bring your wonderful personality and positivity out into the world because the world you know 
the world needs it and it, it's a short time that we're here let's make the most of it and live life uh, to the fullest so yeah